In this tutorial, you will learn how to use auto point logging. Auto point logging is an excellent foundation for making accurate volume calculations. You get consistent, reliable measurements without stressing the operator. This video is the second video out of two. The first video is single point logging. We use the dozer here, but the tutorial covers the following applications. Dozer and Grader. We start in the main run screen. Press main menu. Press as built. Press the auto point logging menu. First, we need a file to store the points in. Press on the file menu. We notice that there is not a file to store the points in. Create a new file by pressing on the plus sign. Give the file name. We call it Highway 20. Press the flag to save and store. Press OK. Select the newly created file. Press OK. In this video, we will not look into point codes. Point codes are explained in the video Single Point Logging. Select where on the plate you want points locked. Here we select left and right. Now you have three options. Enable auto point logging. Enable visualization of the locked points. And enable that auto point logging will start every time hydraulics is in auto mode. The last option is very useful. You prevent human error by having auto point logging automatically on whenever hydraulics is in auto mode. We enable all three options. Decide if new points should be logged with a distance interval or a time interval. We leave it set to distance and to log a point every one meter. Press X to return to run screen. Notice that auto lock is now displayed in yellow on the point logging button. When enabling hydraulic auto, auto lock changes to green and a point will be locked for every one meter. You can see the auto locked points. They are shown as small red squares. To disable auto point locking, long press the point locking button. A menu appears where you can disable auto point locking and visualization of the locked points. Let us try to disable auto point logging. Great! Now, auto lock points will be synchronized with Conics in real time, so anytime new point is locked, it is available for the surveyor. That's it. You have learned how to use auto point logging. 